Hi folks and friends on YouTube. Thanks for being here. I'm Still Dreaming is my channel and in this video I want to read a letter that uh, I got that I received in the mail today and it's from um, Team Kennedy, Robert Kennedy Jr. and Team Kennedy. So I want to go ahead and read this letter and make a video and upload the video to my channel so okay so I have the letter right here in front of me so it says um, Kennedy Shanahan 2024 Road to the White House dear Rebecca if there's ever been a time an independent candidate could win the presidency it's now thanks to friends like you who support my campaign I believe I have the best chance at being the first independent president since George Washington. For the first time in our history, self-identified independents outnumber both Republican and Democratic voters. In June, the Gallup reported 51% of voters are independent. Independents favor me over President Biden or President Trump. So we know that this letter, um, this letter was written before uh, President Biden um, dropped out of the out of the race, and and Kamala Harris stepped in to replace Joe Biden. They didn't go about it the right way, but that's another that's another video. Um, and every single day, more and more Americans. Uh, are turned off by the Trump-Biden campaigns. The debate was embarrassing. The candidates sounded like third graders. Yes, they did. Polls show this is now a three-way race for the White House. It's me against the two-party establish, establishment candidates who are saying the same things they were saying four years ago. The American people are ready for a different way, and that's why I'm running for president. I'm Robert F. Kennedy Jr., but everyone calls me Bobby. I'm <clears throat> my running mate, Nicole Shanahan, and I want to change the way we do politics in America. Let me change the way we do politics in America. Wait, where was I? Uh... Um, what we do? Okay, we are running so we can make a difference for hardworking Americans. This campaign and the support of millions of independent-minded Americans have helped ignite a firestorm across America that has been smoldering for years. Rebecca, I'm writing to ask you if I can count, if I can continue counting on your support. You see, I may be a Kennedy, but I cannot rely on. A party machine or wealthy super donors to fund my campaign I must rely upon independent minded Americans like you whose hearts are moved to support my campaign you recently gave seven hundred three dollars and ninety eight cents and I greatly appreciate your generosity and trust oh by the way I'm reading this letter for the first time I didn't know that you know that was gonna be in there <laughs> Um, I know this may be asking a lot, Rebecca, especially with the economic hardship we're all facing, but would you please consider a special gift to my campaign today? Um, the other, let's see, when did I do it? Saturday? Or was it Sunday? Saturday? Sunday. It, it was either Saturday or Sunday. I, I made a donation, um, a $100 donation, and then I ordered... Um, a flag so I wanted some merchandise okay so moving right along my campaign is a grassroots populist movement pop populist movement bringing all kinds of people together united by a shared passion to see things turn around in this country that means some can afford to give a one-time donation of 30 or 60 dollars others can afford a one-time gift of six $6,600, which is the maximum allowed per candidate. Most are not in a position to give at that level, and I get it. I know how much of a sacrifice a gift like that would be for some people, just like a $60 gift is a sacrifice for others. Whether you give up to the maximum of $6,600 
or you can give 33 or 300 or even 30 I need the support of however ho however people are led to give so please consider your best uh, gift today our campaign is now moving into a critical phase we must all we must go all out to get my name and Nicole's name on every state ballot as well as as well as force us onto the debate stage moving forward the two national party candidates Biden and Trump barely lift a finger to get on the ballot candidates like Nicole and I must meet very stringent very challenging state specific filing requirements deadlines and hurdles just because we declared our independence from the two-party system that's why your help and support today is so vital i need your help to get me onto the debate stage no matter what trump biden the two national political parties and the media say i have the support necessary for me to qualify campaigns that have the support nicole and I have from friends like you, campaigns that have the support Nicole and I have from friends like you, and millions of other Americans should uh, automatically be on a on every ballot and every debate stage. Every American should have the same access to the candidates running to be the president of the United States, which I was not afforded that. The Democratic Party did not afford me that. They didn't have a primary. That means every, okay, so that means being able to hear from the candidates and they should have the opportunity to cast a vote for their name on the ballot. We can't simply look through the time worn glasses of the two major political parties and their candidates, and we can't trust the filter of the national media or the pollsters whose credibility credibility Americans increasingly call into question. That's why over the next 12 to 15 days we must meet our budget goal and raise 1.8 million so we get the Kennedy Shanahan name on every state ballot. We have already gathered signatures in enough states to be eligible for more than 350 electoral votes, way more than the 270 needed to win the election. We are building our ground game with over a hundred thousand volunteers nationwide what is our biggest obstacle ironically it's the idea that an independent can't win in 1992 exit polls showed that if everyone who supported ross perot had voted for him perot would have won they didn't vote for him because they thought he couldn't win in addition to getting the word out about my candidacy and positions we also need funds because it's necessary to defend my name and Nicole's name from all the personal attacks the Democrats and the, Demo the Democrats and the Re Republican establishment are hurling our way um, I think I'm gonna stop here because I don't want the video to be too long I typically like the videos to be like 10 minutes or less so I'll stop there and um, I'll pick up um, another video uh, very soon. All right. Thanks, you guys. Bye for now. Whoops.